Uh, hey everyone, in this video uh, we're going to be going over how to use uh, Descript's uh, text-to-speech AI voice that you can use for videos or reading scripts or whatever you want to use it for. So the first thing you got to do is head over to uh, Descript's website and uh, sign up for an account. And then you can, there is an online editor, um, but I recommend once you, uh, once you sign up for an account, Use the free version if you are just going to use the uh, the text to speech. Uh, there's no reason to uh, pay for any of the uh, the higher uh, upgrade options. So uh, once you sign up for an account and download the uh, program to your computer, uh, open it up and uh, it should bring you to this um, to something like this where the projects page. And uh, so now if you want to use uh, the uh, text-to-speech AI um, you can go ahead and press this blue new button right here and then press audio project and that's going to uh, focus on making uh, the text-to-speech so once you do that you'll be brought into uh, this area right here and this middle section is where you can type whatever you want the the AI text-to-speech to say um, so this big untitled, this is just the, uh, the title of the project or whatever you want to call it. So I'll just call it project one, for example. And then after that, this lower line where it says press enter, uh, you can either do that or just click on it and then it'll bring this start writing section. So you can either write or, uh, type something in, so, uh, or copy something in. So for me, I just ask chat gpt for uh, an example and then you just really just paste it in and then you're good and then to uh start the text to speech using an ai voice uh you want to go ahead and hit uh, add speaker at the top left of the paragraph and then you want to select browse stock ai speakers and then um all these different lists of names of people will come up uh, for whatever kind of voice you're looking for. Um, so if you want to just see what they sound like, you can go ahead and just, uh, life is like a camera button right next just to Just focus name. on what's important and then capture the good times. You'll hear what Develop that voice from the would negatives. Like. And if things don't work out, so, just take um, another shot. Once you go ahead and, uh, pick the voice you want, uh, just go ahead and, uh, double click it. And then after that, you'll see the, uh, the words will start to flash and that means it's uh turning in, into a uh, ai speech and this will uh this will only just take a minute or two um some other things you can do is uh down here at the uh, down by the fast forward button there is the playback speed and you can um adjust how you want to uh how fast you want the ai to uh speak so um you can just increase speed uh, down here if you want to have a more custom one, or you can just select one of these. And then also in the uh, top left right here, you have this actions button. You can click that, and then you can do um, different kinds of things like find words or search in the script. Um, you can also shorten word gaps. So like if there's like uh, a long break between sentences or something, you click that and it'll get rid of that. And then you can also um, remove filler words, which are like, um, and like a lot of words that like you don't want normally when speaking. Okay, so um, you can tell that the uh, AI speech is done talking or uh, done generating when uh, the words stop flashing and they become solid again. And then you can also see uh, how long the speech is down here. So um, if you want to hear what it sounds like, you just go ahead and press play at in the heart of the bustling city, where the sounds of traffic and the hum of conversations intertwine, a quaint bookstore stands as a haven for book enthusiasts. The aroma of aged paper and leather-bound volumes wafts through the air as you step inside, greeted by shelves that seem to reach for the ceiling, each one crammed with stories waiting to be explored. The soft glow of reading lamps create... Like, uh, Descript's AI text-to-speech sounds pretty good, especially for being, a. Uh especially since you can use it for free. So um, once your text is generated and you're done editing it and everything, uh, you wanna go ahead and save it and export it. So to do that, you uh, press uh, publish over here in the uh, top right, click that, 
and then in the top left of the drop down menu you want to hit export and then you just want to do the uh, leave it on audio and then uh, the export you want to do current composition and then format um, you can do any of these I usually just leave it mp3 uh, this metadata thing you don't need to touch and uh, advanced um, you can change the bit rate um, if you want sample rate channels and uh the normalize the volume i leave it at minus uh 14 luffs as that's the best if you're going to uh, use it for youtube and once you're done with all your settings uh you just want to hit export and then you'll be able to save it wherever you want so let's just say i want to save it to my desktop go ahead and click desktop and then you can change the name of where you want the file and you can just press save and then it's going to uh Export down here in the bottom right, it'll tell you when it's done. And then to check it out, you just press open. And then you can go find it on your desktop. So it's uh, right here, so go ahead. click. In the heart button. of the bustling city, where the sounds of traffic and the hum of conversations right intertwine, a quaint bookstore stands as a haven for book enthusiasts. The aroma of aged paper and leather-bound volumes wafts through the air as you step use uh, Descript's AI text-to-speech so you can now use it for uh, the AI text yeah, for YouTube videos it's good enough to uh, get by for that and uh, so yeah mm -hmm.